Hey guys, Brandon here with another Lincoln Homes for Sale update through April 2023. Let's go. We're actually seeing the average price per square foot go up for the second month in a row. So it went from 296 to 312, now $316 a square foot. We're moving in the right direction. Right now in Lincoln, California, there's 104 active homes for sale. There's 63 that have sold and 77 that are currently pending. This time last year, we had 117 pending. We have less pending because we really just have less inventory. I think the market's still real competitive, but with limited inventory, there's a reason why, and I'm gonna cover that later on in the video, but with limited inventory, it's making it really, really competitive, especially for houses under 600,000. Some good news here for home sellers. We saw the average list price versus sold price. We saw that go up. So houses are selling for 95% of what they're listed for. Overall, keep in mind in Lincoln, we had a, have a lot of high-end properties in, in Catavadera and 12 Bridges and things like that. So uh, you have some lower entry level properties and you have the multi-million dollar listings, but it is up 1% from last month, which is a good sign. Also, we actually have the average days on market that has gone down. So it was 61 days, now it is 50 days. So it's gone down 11 days in one month. That means the houses are getting into contract quicker which is good. The average sold price has gone up from 655 last month to 723,000 this month. Now this number is also kind of hard. It's always going to jump up and down. It depends on uh, whether the higher price homes are selling or the lower price ones are selling, but it's always something we want to keep an eye on. So months of inventory is if we didn't list any other houses, how long would it take us to run out with the average sales that we have? Last month, we were 1.2 months. This month, we're 1.7 months. So we're seeing an increase. Now, again, that could be for houses that maybe were pending and fell out of contract. So the, the, uh, the more expensive custom homes, those are taking longer to sell as well. So they're still on the market, which is increasing that inventory month over month, if that makes sense. So Lincoln is one of those cities where there's a lot of opportunity in a lot of different price ranges. So uh, this information is good for you, but everything kind of depends on your house specifically. Even those are a little bit more inventory in Lincoln. I'll tell you right now, if your house is under 600,000, it will probably sell in less than a week. And this is because the inventory is still low overall with the California Dream for All program uh, that just ran out of money. It was only alive for like 10 days The 300 million ran out. It gave first time home buyers an opportunity to buy a house and they were giving them 20% down. Now there's a whole bunch of stuff behind that, but the bottom line is a lot of homes are locked up. And so there's an opportunity right now. So if you're thinking about listing your house at all in Lincoln, you definitely wanna get the process started by downloading our Max Price Home Sale System Guide. It's a five-step process. And this is what we've been using to show our clients how to maximize their profit, get their house ready to sell quickly in five days or less for top dollar. So download that below now. So make sure to check out our market update next month in Lincoln so that you can see exactly what's going on. And I'm curious to see what happens. Not all the California Dream for All buyers that got in a contract are going to close and we wanna see if they're all gonna get their money. Uh, so this is kind of that new program. They close it down so fast. So we're gonna see if houses are gonna come flooding back on the market or they're all gonna sell and we're gonna have another month of limited inventory, which is again, good for sellers to maximize their profit. So I'll see you guys next time.